Ian, quite a contrast from Wembley, but the result felt almost as important and uh, a tremendous three points. Yeah, I mean, my, my enjoyment from Sunday was for the fan base, um, for the ownership group, Sharon, and the rest of them, um, uh, for the players and, and everyone associated with the club. But I take more enjoyment from that, um, a win away from home against the team that have won the last four home games. Um, first half, we were exceptional, you know, controlled the game, controlled the ball. Only, you know, slight knock from me is that we didn't put the game to bed. Uh, we had some good situations, some really good scenarios where our f final pass let us down. Uh, but second half was, was the opposite to that, just guts, determination. You have to do that away from home. So really proud of the players. It was tough after what we've been through Sunday emotionally and then a bit of adversity this week, losing Rico and, and Owen. But people have stood up today and um, I'm really proud of them. Is that the defender and you speaking? Because you had to build, rebuild that back three today and, and they've kept a clean sheet, which was massive testament. Yeah, had to rebuild it with, with Luke, who's 19 and still learning his trade. George Johnson's not played since January um, in a competitive league match. So, yeah, it's, it's great to keep a clean sheet and really proud of them for standing up. Right, just give us an update on Rico. Obviously, the skipper is injured and is going to be missed by anybody. Yeah, it's, it's not ideal. He's got a thigh injury um, at the moment. You know, we'll see how quickly it settles, but it's not going to be quickly like next week. Um, but we're hoping for some fast healing. Um, Owen the same really, he's, he's going to be missing for a while but it is what it is, we've not had much luck with injuries so in turn we have to find a way and, and trust the process and we'll do that and as I said if they stand up like they have today that game will do John Owen and loot the world of good and they'll improve for it. Yeah, you're going to need everybody and that was shown today with the substitutions and as you said, the, the exertions of last yeah. Sunday everybody had to, to dig in and play their part. Exactly that really, uh, I think the subs helped the second half, gave us some energy and some fresh impetus. Um, and yeah, we're going to have to utilise the squad for Monday. That game is now gone, it's parked, and now we have to focus on the next half of football, not even the game, just the next half, win the next half of football, which is Monday. Um, and from this point on, we have to do all we can to prepare and be ready. Moment of real quality for the winning goal, lovely through all from Josh yeah. and Connor Bradley kept his cool. Yeah, as I said, some of our play first half was breathtaking, the way we built back to front, I don't think they knew what to stick, well, whether to stick or twist. Um, but we we played through. We were progressive, and Connor's finished it really well. I'm, I'm delighted for him. But yeah, second half was all about guts and determination. And sometimes, as an in possession football team, you can be labelled a bit of a soft touch. There's none of that from us today. It was it was gutsy. It was full blooded, and it was determined to make sure we got to, took the three points home special. Mention to the fans, the over a thousand that, that have travelled here today after a really expensive weekend. It means the world to me, the world to the players, and they got us over the line, so thanks very much for travelling. Yeah, you can see what it meant to the fans and the players at the end, because at this stage it goes without saying, but winning is everything. It is, and as I said, it's, it's tight, but it's what we're in it to win it, really. And uh, yeah, we just have to focus on ourselves, focus on our next half, don't get too far ahead, just just win the next half and see where that takes us. So lastly, we go back home on Monday. It's going to be a huge crowd, possibly even a sellout yeah. at the stadium. It is a day of celebration, but equally a day to, to work again and, and try and get... Yeah, and points. this this group needs to be lifted and needs to be pushed forwards. And I have no doubt that our fan base are going to do that for us. It's going to be an incredible atmosphere. and We have to make sure that our performance gets bombs off seats.